action. Uh, good evening, uh, uh, Professor Lopez. Good evening, my classmate. Uh, my presentation title is the Americans Independence Day. I interviewed my uh, my friends. Name <coughs> Jonathan 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 Grimes. Uh, is my friend. We worked uh, together in my country in 2005, and now he uh, lives in Big Stone Gap in West uh, Virginia. I asked him some some questions uh, about this day. So I asked him uh, why it's called Independence Day. Uh, he replied and said it's the day that the Second Continental Congress. Uh, 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 declaration from from uh, from uh, uh, British, <coughs> the Britain. And then I asked him uh, when and where uh, they start to separate on this day. So he he replied to me. He said on fourth of July in 1777, and they started in uh, uh, Philadelphia. And after that, I asked him also, what's the traditional things uh, in this day? Uh, he said uh, the general things or traditional things uh, in this day, like uh, picnic, games, candles, <coughs> uh, and cook outside. Uh, but the most uh, not uh, the most notable uh, things is the fireworks. After that, I asked him also how the people celebrate in this uh, day. Uh, he said uh, generally the people uh, join with the families and with the family and the friends uh, to celebrate in this day. Uh, then I asked him, uh, do you like uh, this day and why? <coughs> uh, he strongly agreed with that, and he said, I look forward for this day all year long. And because he joined with his family and some friend uh, to celebrate in this day. Uh, finally, I asked him, "What else can you tell me about this day?" He said, uh, "All the Americans they like this day uh, because now they have all rights uh, and uh, and liberty uh, that cannot uh, uh, cannot ignore." So this is my interview uh, for Independence Day. I hope it's uh, get some information to you also to know about this day. So thank you, everyone. Thank you.